This is Pam from NortheastWheelsEvents.com, the 2017 Das Ochtfest. Now I'm going to butcher the name as usual. We're going to do a little caddy walkabout. This is a 47. Just beautiful. One of the few post war classics, true classics, voted to the classic status by the Classic Car Club of America. We got the chrome bows inside, that's nice. Electric windows on this girl. The spotlights. I love the uh, tune every Wednesday night uh, to my Dorsey, Tommy Dorsey. And this, of course, is before the fins were coming in. It's a great showing of Cadillacs here, probably about two dozen uh, at least cars uh, of all vintages. Interesting color, I like that. One of the last years of the big Eldos. Not quite the last year, was this a 75? I'm doing this from memory, folks, so don't hold it against me. Let's see how good I am. Up, oh, 76. 77 was last year. They had the chrome right along the um, uh, belt line, up uh, right underneath the um, windows. These are just beautiful. I love these. This was 7? 58? 7. I am right. 57. Of course, the Coupe de Ville. It's interesting with the wraparound windshield that they went to, the dog legs were like Notorious for knocking kneecaps. Why does this phone keep going out of focus? Let's see if I get it into focus. There we go. Sorry, folks. Nice fins. Tastefully done. Very interesting. What was intriguing was the uh, Chevy had uh, followed suit so much so that there was actually a car called the El Morocco, which was in quote unquote production, which imitated the 57 Cadillac. They also did it in 56. This is the uh, Seville, the rebirth of the Seville. Uh, second generation, if you shall. Has the um, hood, the added uh, grill. This is the Roadster, so it's got no the ribbed uh, vinyl top. That slant back really set uh, people it's either a love it or a hate it design. Very striking in the Roadster with the vinyl, which was uh, of course uh, very, very common at that point. These hubcaps were always intriguing. They're uh, screwed on with a screw underneath the emblem. Uh, very, very heavy. And it's funny is in the time when they were beginning to lighten the cars, uh, they would put something like that on there. The size of these girls. With the wide whites. Very nice. A little 60. What's great with this uh, show, uh, I'm going to try again, uh, yeah, Das Ochtfest in McCungie, Pennsylvania. It brings in a lot of variation. Uh, this is, of course, a 60. Look at these character lines running right down. I'm going to get the interior in a minute, folks. Bear with me. They calmed it down so much, but still was such of a striking, striking uh, line and design. Look at this acreage of sheet metal. Still had the concave dash. That lit up at night looks like you should be in a, a vintage theater. Again, this is Pam from NortheastWheelsEvents.com. Wait a minute here. This thing says it's a 59? No. No, 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 no. 
No, no. That's weird. Well, I'll hear back, but I'm saying 60, folks. Number of professional cars here, too. Here's a uh, flower car. I'm not sure who built it. Let's check it out. Uh, it's got the 468. Another interesting experiment by GM uh, trying to survive the uh, fuel crunches which were hitting. Uh, that and then of course the infamous diesel. The way how that was done. Intriguing. Let's check out the LaSalle. There were two LaSalles here. LaSalle of course was the baby sister of the Cadillac. Uh, this is where uh, Bill Mitchell actually got his start. Uh, Harley Earl, excuse me, Harley Earl got his start with the um, LaSalle grill and that was really something. The chevrons on the fenders. This one does not have the chevrons. It's a later car. Still a very striking design. They phased this out once uh, in the uh, 40s once the use was up, uh, the economy was back. Ah, this is a 39. Very pretty car. And a 63. Now there's everything from the Alante on through here, Eldos, you name it. Again, this is Pam from NortheastWheelsEvents.com doing a quick walk about uh, the uh, Cadillac display for you guys, uh, specifically for you Cadillac fans. And I'll be shooting this out. Make sure you share this video, have some fun. You can see the variation of Cadillac, your favorite make, and the appreciation. For more cool events like this, make sure you check NortheastWheelsEvents.com, SoutheastWheelsEvents.com, UKWheelsEvents.com, and yes, you can post your uh, shows directly onto the calendar. Come join all of us and promote your shows to all of us gearheads.